Have you ever pondered the authenticity of love? Does the notion of artificially induced affection, like that created through a love spell, ever cause you to question its genuineness? Imagine a love born out of manipulation, love that may wane as the spell wears off. It's a thought to mull over, isn't it? Now let's dive into a concept that could be considered the antithesis of this artificial love, energy manipulation. It's an idea rooted in the belief that every living entity is surrounded by an aura, an energy field that can be tapped into and altered. Energy manipulation doesn't force feelings, it simply adjusts the frequencies in your vicinity, nudging you towards positivity and openness. Picture it as a gentle nudge rather than a forceful push. It's about setting the stage for potential bonds rather than dictating the script of the play. It's about creating an environment where love can bloom naturally instead of planting a seed of forced affection. But how does this work, you might ask? Energy manipulation operates on the principle of interconnectivity. Each of us, in our own unique way, is a powerhouse of energy. We give off vibes, we receive vibes, and we interact with the energy fields of others. By consciously manipulating our energy, we can influence these interactions, subtly changing our own energy and the energy around us. So, let's take a moment to recap what we've explored. We started by questioning the authenticity of love born out of manipulation, like that created by love spells. We then delved into the concept of energy manipulation, an alternative that promotes natural bonds by adjusting the energy around us. In essence, energy manipulation doesn't dictate the course of love, but rather sets the stage for it. It's about fostering an environment where love can bloom organically, rather than forcing affection through artificial means. It's about the gentle nudge, not the forceful push. It's about creating a space for love to grow, not planting a seed of forced affection. So the next time you find yourself contemplating love and its authenticity, remember to consider the energy that surrounds us all. Consider the power of a gentle nudge over a forceful push. Consider the beauty of love that blooms naturally, rather than under the compulsion of a spell. And above all, remember that true love is never forced, but always found.